hello my dear students how are you all so today in this video we are going to learn how to measure angles by using the protector so first of all let me tell you what is a protector a protector is an geometrical instrument and it has two scales the inner scale from right hand side to the left hand side the outer scale from the left hand side to the right hand side and this protector is used to measure the angles and angles are from 0 degree to 180 degree are marked on both the scales so one scale read the angles clockwise this one 0 to 10 reads clockwise and 0 to 10 this side the inner scale reads anti-clockwise so now let us see how to measure the angles so here on this chart I have few angles drawn already now I will tell you how to measure these angles one by one so first of all the first step to measure the angle is taken take a protector and place the center point this center point this is the center point children this one this one is the center point of the protector we need to place this center point on the vertex of the angle what is a vertex these are the two arms this arm this is an arm ma and md is in another arm and m is the point is the vertex so we need to place the center of the protector on the vertex like this and we need to adjust the protector in such a way that the baseline coincides with the arm the base arm of the angle like this and then afterwards we need to check the scale which scale we are going to use we are going to use the outer scale which is going clockwise or we need to go check the take the inner scale which is anti-clockwise so we will take that scale which is on the baseline where the baseline arm is there so baseline is this side so we need to see from this so we are going to see from this we need to check that where this line lies 0 10 20 30 40 and as you can see that this line is lying between 40 and 50 so it this angle is measures as 45 degrees so we are going to write down angle a m d equals to 45 degrees now let me tell you the next one again the same procedure we are going to place the center of the protector on the vertex like this and then again we are going to check that scale where the baseline arms to zero degree this is here the baseline is at the right hand side so we are going to take the inner scale which is going anti-clockwise this side 0 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 100 110 120 that means this angle measures 120 degree why we have not taken 60 degree because 60 degree must be there whenever we are starting the outer scale we are taking the outer scale but as we are taking the inner scale so this is here angle p m r equals to 120 degree okay children now let us see the next one again the same procedure what is this yes you are absolutely right this angle means this angle measures one equals to 90 degrees because it is here lying on this let us check again it is lying on this 90 degrees so we need to say angle x y z equals to 90 degrees now let us see the la last angle of this page again the same procedure we are going to place the center of the protector over this baseline and we are going to check from the inner scale because baseline is this side right side 0 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 and 80 so between 70 and 80 it will be 65 
no 85 no it is between 670 and 80 so it will be 75 so angle l m n equals to 75 degree so here in this chart we have seen the angles which in which we have seen the inner scale from right hand side to the left hand side now i have few more angles to measure here we go so first of all again let me check this angle so this is the vertex over here so we need to place the center point of the protector over this work vertex now you can see children the baseline is both side this side as well and this side as well so i can take any one and as i can see it is going to 0 to 180 degree or if i'm taking this one 0 to 180 degree again so that means this angle is known as it measures a angle a r m equals to 180 degrees now children let us move to the next one here again i'm placing this over this center point now children it is a little bit different we they have the baseline towards left side that means we are going to see the zero which is at left side which is the outer scale so we are going to count 0 10 20 30 that means this angle x y z equals to 30 degree very good now next angle this one again we are going to place the center and again we can see that it is also left hand side so we are going to see the zero which is at left hand side the outer scale and it is going towards this side which is equal to 140 degree so angle r q p equals to 140 degree so here children are taking the approximate values of the angles now let us see the last angle Again, I am placing here left hand side 0 to 70. So it is angle KLM equals to 70 degrees. So I hope children you have understood that how to measure the angles using the protector. In our next video, we are going to see the we are going to learn the types of angles. As well as in the next video we are going to see how to draw these angles it will be more interesting lesson so till then stay safe stay at home bye bye take care